Hi everybody, Dan Stiefel here with Crestal Health Periodontics. I'm here to talk about um, the importance of home care and how the process of home care can actually break down and become ineffective at preventing periodontal disease in the future. So, uh, as we remember from previous videos, and you're certainly welcome to visit our, visit our other videos and take a look at them, um, we know that periodon periodontal health has a few different levels to it. We have clinical health, which is easy to maintain. We have uh, gingivitis, which is bleeding gums uh, and gums that may bleed with brushing or spontaneously. And then we have periodont periodontitis, which is, um, which is periodontal bone loss from the tooth. That can lead to tooth loss and abscesses and things like that. Um, we're here to help today to try to keep us out of those situations where uh, things can go wrong from, from a, a gum perspective. So when it comes to keeping things healthy and keeping things maintainable, um, we often in our practice see patients that are brushing their teeth multiple times per day. So it's not, um, it's not for lack of desire that these people break down. Um, they may be brushing their teeth all day long with the bristles of a toothbrush hitting their teeth right here. But the problem is the food is getting stuck down here or something like that. And so the food can stick too long on the tooth. It'll turn into plaque as we've said before and that will turn to tartar which catches more food, which turns into plaque, which catches more tartar, etc., etc., etc. So that bad pathway is able to occur. Now, um, the reasons why things can go wrong from a periodontal perspective, um, from a home care perspective, is because of, I think, five issues. Number one, we have to have the right instruments. If we've got spaces, some people have a missing tooth, some people are, are, have all their teeth, some people have little spaces between their teeth, some people have big spaces between their teeth, some people have short teeth, some people have long teeth. Um, all those things are going to play a role to make sure that whatever instruments we're using for a particular space to remove food and plaque, it must be the appropriate instrument for you and you're going to be different than anybody else in the world. Having the right instruments is key, that's number one. Number two, being able to have the knowledge to understand how to use those instruments. That's an important thing as well. Without the knowledge of how to use a particular instrument around a particular space, um, that's going to end up breaking down as well. Number three, once we've figured out a good process on how to clean every space in the mouth with a customized instrument, uh, and then we know how to use that instrument, we have to be able to replace exactly that instrument for that particular spot in the mouth on a pretty regular basis, like every two to three months. Well, what happens if we can't find that instrument in a regular store? We've got CVS or Walgreens or some other drugstore nearby, but nobody has this particular pretty fancy little instrument that's necessary for these five or six spaces in my mouth. What am I going to do? We need a way to go ahead and replace them predictably on a regular basis. Number three, we have to be able to review our training methods. Just human nature dictates the fact that after a little while we forget some of the details that are involved in every single process. So if we review them every three to six months, we can keep ourselves fresh and kind of keep ourselves mo moving in a very good positive direction to keep us out of trouble. And number five, we have to have the motivation. There's nothing that I can do to be able to help a person with this. This has to come from within each person to be able to have the motivation to take care of themselves at home appropriately. But I might be able to help with these first four steps here. So that's a little discussion on how to keep things, keep things moving in the right direction and keep you out of trouble. And I hope this helps. Have a great day.